What's up guys, welcome back to another accessory video review. I won't be reviewing this uh, silicone mask because I've already done that in one of my previous videos. I just want to say that I will be getting rid of it. I've uh, used it before uh, when I used this original face mask, I put this silicone on top. And well, what I got in return is that I've uh, preserved this uh, spongy material which would certainly soak up many nasty things inside it and since, since it's not washable I wanted to protect it as much as possible so I won't be using that anymore and uh, I like actually this uh, original face mask I didn't have like leakage on the sides and it fit well on my face uh, I just uh, felt that something is not right and I wanted to mod it somehow which didn't go well and let me now show you I got this one instead it's a VR letter face cushion from AMVR and the back of the box if you want to see it although it's mostly in Chinese it's 65 grams and other than that not much more so what you get in the package of course the face mask itself so it's some very high quality plastics and this face cushion is already attached to, to it and how it attaches it, you actually have velcro tape uh, on this base I will try to focus it it's uh, very sticky and you just need to press it on these parts and it stays on so it's very convenient I won't uh, peel, peeling it off all the way around because I've uh, matched it uh, perfectly but it's easy to take off and clean it just uh, with some wet clothes and pure water and nothing more is really needed it's really easy to be cleaned and uh, it uh, actually attaches uh, to the Pico 4 magnetically it has uh, three magnets on, on each sides I can show you if I for example take this glass spacer this is the original part it all uh, it has these uh, magnets here and see now this so it just snaps so if it, it must be uh, magnetic and uh, let me show you what else you get in the package you have this no silicon part we have similar one from uh, Pico but I like this one more because of this I will show you now when you attach it then you have this let me try to focus that you have these two little uh, just like some pegs on uh, each of the sides and you can fix this nose part into these two places so when it's uh, fully mounted it uh, doesn't fly for around and it cannot fall which uh, cannot be set for the original face mask and I also don't have light leakage on the sides from this face mask and it perfectly fits my face here are the ventilations so the lens don't get fogged I just uh, noticed when I'm under some heavy uh, light on my ceiling then I can see some light pouring in but a really tiny amount and that only happens if I'm directly under the light but uh, it's not actually a problem 
and you have some instructions in the box although you won't need it because it's very simple to put all together then uh, I also got this in my package so it's a additional VR silicon mask so uh, this is made of silk some really nice material it really uh, feels great on the skin but I would say that uh, over time it would uh, get uh, very sticky and uh, dirty uh, it's actually a little bit thicker than the one I showed you uh, before and I have some uh, from before when I was trying to mod my face mask which didn't go well it's all ruined but uh, I can also stick this uh, on the velcro and they are usable although they are not very good looking oops but this one is very thick very thin and when attached to the velcro my eyes are really up close and I get the most uh, FOV out of it but uh, around the nose, nose I, uh, I uh, noticed that it's not really comfortable so I decided to use this one since it's the best for the comfort and I also get a uh, much better fove uh, than uh, with the original mask and let me finally show how it actually attaches to the Pico 4 just like the original face mask you just put it like here and when it snaps into the place it looks like this and if you want to see when you compare it with the original face mask on the sides they are actually on par maybe AMVR is a little bit uh, wider and looking it from this position they are quite the same but I think AMVR is a little bit bigger and here we can see that maybe even the original mask is narrower than AMVR but all of that doesn't matter because when you put it on your face your eyes are much closer to the lenses and you get bigger, bigger FOV than with original face mask and if it's better on my face at least and uh, it's much more comfier and let me show you you also get in the package this uh, and we are I think it's microfiber and it's really magic I really need to say that because it only gets one or two swipes on your lenses and they are clear as day I've tried many other before and I just rubbing and rubbing and rubbing and you cannot get it correct and with this one only one or two swipes like two circles on the lenses and it's all clean so it's really a magic and before I show you one last thing uh, I would just like you to smash that like button if you enjoy my content and if you're not subscribed to my video I would really appreciate it if you could do so so you uh, are probably wondering if you can use your prescription glasses with this uh, AMVR face mask and I can con confirm that you can I've taken off my lenses because I wanted you to see this face mask more clearly so if I attach my lenses back on the Pico then you will see that AMVR mask snaps in just as before and I use them both at the same time and 
it's really uh, uh, as comfortable as before with the old mask and uh, the part around my nose is not obstructed uh, there's nothing on my eyes and uh, it's not th that my forehead gets uh, something somewhere around here so it's really comfortable and I'm using them uh, like they are not here so all is well and good and this is my current setup and I will be using it like that so yeah I'm really happy with how it uh, feels on my face so uh, that was all I wanted to show you in this uh, video thanks for watching I really hope that you liked it uh, thanks for stopping by and see you in the next one Thank you.